Hey there, Bob from Oregon's Constant Gardener. Welcome to the OCG Fam Show. So today, over there, I'm looking over there because the tea machine's over there. We're gonna make the tea. We uh, got the whole machine set up yesterday, got some water in there, bubbled the, that's what I wanna talk to you about, uh, the chlorine. We bubbled the chlorine out of the water. And I said that the municipal water here in Springfield is uh, has chloramine in it, and that that would bubble out from just bubbling it. I got it wrong. I actually knew what the correct thing was. I just reversed it on the show. So let me make this clear. Chloramine is in some cities' waters, and if you have the chloramine in there, you're gonna have to treat that or something, because days and days of bubbling that will not get that out of there. If you have chlorine, like we do here, which I said the opposite, but it's chlorine that we have here, that bubbling this stuff up for 12, 15 hours, that's gonna be more than fine to get that out of there. So, my mistake, sorry about that. What else do I got going? I got a couple of announcements. Actually, I only have one announcement, and then we'll get on with making the tea. That announcement is that Gary Fast from Triminator, they make the trimmers for trimming your, uh, trimming your herb there. They're going to be here. He's going to be here on October 27th to uh, tell us all about the machine. So he'll be here locally if you want to come down and see the show. If you're in town, it's fine. You should hang out with me. We'll uh, hang out with Gary. We'll talk about that. We'll do that. He'll show us how the thing works and the whole thing. And then, uh, you know, we'll have some fun. So that's what's going on. If, uh, if you're not here in town, we're still going to do that live. So on the Friday the 27th, we'll have a green room live, uh, streaming live on the Facebook. That's the only announcement. So let's uh, let's get to the tea. Come on over. Okay, so we got the thing all set up here. I, I turned it off so it wouldn't be so loud. We'll turn it back on in here a second. And then I've got the stuff to make the recipe. So we don't need that. Uh, the bag, that's what I was going to talk to you about, was the bag yesterday I showed you. So what this bag is for is, uh, it's a tea bag. Just like a tea bag when you're making tea at home with the Earl Grey. Hot. You take the stuff and you put it in there. So that's what we're going to do. Now I have a recipe here. We'll get into recipes on one of the next shows as far as uh, different recipes and stuff. But I'll just go through it quickly for now so we can just show the basic. We don't need that. Basic process of getting this thing down. So let's do that. First up is uh, some worm castings. Good stuff. Good stuff for your tea here. So we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna open this up and uh, look at my recipe here. It says we need uh, two scoops of the worm castings. That's what we're gonna do here. Put that out there. Okay. There's one good scoop. Oh! Criminy. You know what? We're gonna start over. All right, all right, we're gonna start over. Okay, I got a plan now. See, I'm new to doing this. I've never actually done this. I don't know why I'm showing you when I don't even know how to do it myself, but that's the, that's the nature of the job, I guess. So, here we go, we're learning together. So two scoops of the worm castings. All right, and then, uh, the favorite of our buddy Jeff Lowenfels. Jeff Lowenfels, let me talk to you about that. Jeff Lowenfels, teeming with microbes. And now you see it's not teeming T-E-E, -E, it's teeming T-A-M, I-N-G, teeming. We're making a team with the microbes. We're gonna work together with them. So uh, I want you to look at that book. I want you to get that book and read it because that's what we're gonna be talking about here uh, going forward on the show. But for now, get our Alaskan humus straight from Alaska. Two scoops of this as well. Oops, down there. One. Two scoops. Now, I'm going to put this in here. Let me show you how you do this. So I'm not sure exactly myself, but what you do is you roll this thing over a couple of times to get that sealed up. And then you take it like that, put that in there. See, now I'm going to set that in there, but I think what I'm going to do, because i got to get it to kind of hang in there, is I'm going to use some of this just uh, twist tie stuff. You know, you could probably got some of this in your house for tying up your plants. There we go. So I'm gonna tie that around here. Oops. All right. All right. Set that inside. Come on down in there, guy. Okay. So we want that down in there, but we don't want to obstruct the uh, the airflow there. Oh, it's already teeing up in there. Get that on here. Okay. I think we're good to go there. Now, let's talk about this stuff. Molasses, and then we're using Zeus juice and Poseidon's Now these two, 
are uh, kind of a more refined and a more complex version of uh, humic acid and kelp, which are some things you'd normally put in tea, and those are what we're going to put in here. Let me go get a measuring cup for those. So we're doing 10 gallons here, and we're going to put in uh, 120 milliliters of molasses. So let's get that going. Alright, okay. Maybe if I should shake that up, you think? It doesn't shake, right? But you know, might as well. Okay. And then in there, 120. There we go, 120 milliliters of that. That's some thick stuff. We can make some pancakes later, put some of that on there. And then our Zeus juice, our humic acid, we're gonna do uh, 50 milliliters of that. All right. 50 milliliters, put that in there. And then our Poseidon Zyme, which is our uh, our kelp uh, replacement. That mixed up real good. We're going to do 75 milliliters of this. All right. This has been a uh, fault free show so far. Nothing's really gone wrong, which is uh, it's nice for a change. There we go. Okay. So that's that. We got all the stuff in there. And then it's really just as simple as that. We turn that on. And then just let that buzz there for, uh, oh, you know, a good 12 hours. Now, you know, in our next show, we'll talk about how you can make this go a little faster with uh, some of the instant teas. But uh, that's it for now. And uh, so check out the book if you can. Let's talk about that some more. We'll talk about some teas some more. And then you tell me what you want to talk about. We'll just keep this all going and learning how to do this together. So thanks for watching.